Is there anything I might have seen you in? Or um, well, I've done a couple of bits and bobs, um, some stage, radio, TV, film, uh, a couple of audiobooks and some adverts, and oh, and of course, I'm the voice of Siri. You're the voice of Siri? Go ahead, I'm listening. I'm the voice of Siri. Great. Yeah, well, whenever you're ready. Sure thing, right into it. <clears throat> Waited, I waited, I waited for 15 years, and for what? You never changed. Every day I'd ask why I was still here, and the only answer I had was because I loved you, and because you loved me, but you never did, did you? Oof. Please don't do this. We can't let such a good thing fall apart just because I don't know how to blow out candles. I don't think you know how hard it's been for me. Oh. That was delicious. Shall we? Yeah, right. <laughs> Do you reckon we got too many candles lit? No, no, I like it. I just think, you know, there's relaxing and then there's over the top, and I think this might be a bit over the top. It's fine. I'll just blow one out. <laughs> <laughs> the show by the way guys it's really great <laughs> cheers have a good one it's the mystery ball listen Heinz, Sir, Campbell, Forster are all dead. I don't know about the others. First story, I need Heinz to confirm this. How he's dead he's actually dead yes why would I make that up there's a thing a thing yes like the thing like an alien Maybe. Well, no, not like the thing, but a thing. Like aliens? No, not like aliens. So, like... Shut up. The stairs bring us out here, and that's a distance of about 20 feet to the vending machine. Are the stairs up or down? Well, they're, they're both. If you're at the top, then they go down. But then if you, if you happen to be at the bottom of the stairs, then they swap and go up. Up and down up to the, up, up up to to the, the door, door, but down from, from the, the door. door. Yeah. Right. So it's uh, down. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. But up. But, yeah. yeah. Omnipresent. <sighs> no. Um, no, it's data which we use to find out what our customers, um, sorry, uh, children want. And that data is then compiled into a list which we then check twice. And that list just helps us to establish who's been naughty and who's been nice. It's a really simple operation, really. AVENGE ME! No. Just avenge me! What? Why? JUST FUCKING AVENGE ME, YOU PRICK! I don't want to avenge you, Kevin. Why not? Because I don't like you very much. Because you're a, a cock. Please. Matt, please. Pat, why don't you just say that you'll avenge me? I'll make him happy. Fine. Kevin, if it makes that much difference, then oh my god! Oh no, he's he's dead. It's hard to enjoy this after the guy playing Harold got accused of sexual harassment. Come on, Harold. You and me both know that the only date a woman has ever given you is for a court summons. <laughs> oh, why don't we just creep block Harold out the show? What? Creep block? It's a new feature that lets you acknowledge that someone is problematic so you can carry on watching the show without feeling complicit. Look. <laughs> <laughs> now I can watch guilt-free. Him and the others. I'm not letting her in until you admit that she was asking me out! <laughs> Don't worry, Eloise. You're safe with me. I'm gonna ask you one more time, Ludo. What were you doing on the night of the 14th? I will never tell you what I did. That was my Shakespeare. Would you like me to move on to my modern? That would be lovely, thank you. Sure thing. For my modern, I have chosen to do Park Life by Blur. I mean, who's that gut lord marching? You know, you'd, you should cut down on your pork life, mate. Get some exercise. Me, I, I wake up when I want. Except on Wednesdays, when I get rudely awakened by the dustman. And I put my trousers on. I have a cup of tea. And I think about leaving the house. 